Good morning. Welcome to Goodwill Commodities. In this video presentation, we are going to see how we can trade in MCX copper market today. Before looking into that, let us see what happened yesterday and what we expected yesterday. This red color candlestick indicates yesterday's price opening, which shows that market open here 417. What we expected uh, yesterday was we made it very clear with various examples that 416 is going to be the key zone. If the price is trading above 416, it has got all the potential to gain its buying strength and also with the convergence of moving average into this particular area make this zone again a special area. Right after the price opening, our charting tool is also providing a warning signal that the price is approaching 416 and you can see uh, after that the price took the clear support around 416 and provided a bounce back. Then again our charting tool giving a a uh, blue color indication stating that the momentum can be on the buying side so slowly and steadily the price went up till 419.5 and so many times the price tried to break this finally closed around 418.55 yesterday in our video presentation i had shown you various uh, dates where the price had traveled in this 419 420 and 422 zones still the price could not clear 420 and 422 as these are all the very major resistance zone so what we can do today, how we can position ourselves for today's trading because in the last three days the price is struggling to clear this zone. Today the expected price opening can be somewhere near the same area where the market closed on the previous day. Again it is going to be like a continuation of what happened on the previous day. Our entire focus will be again on 416. Still we are not out of danger because we didn't uh, even though the price closed higher compared to the yesterday's price opening. Still, we can see that the price is very much um, struggling to clear 420 zone. But we are expecting copper to stay in uptrend and maintain its trend as a trend follower. We always give our first preference for trend. But have your complete focus on 416. If the price is uh, breaking or coming down below 416, it is going to be a complete negative signal for bias. So let us see what's going to happen during the trading session. As usual, you can depend on our charting tool to keep you in the right direction throughout the trading session. Thanks a lot for watching our videos. Happy trading. Take care. Bye.